Hey friends, today we are hanging out at Disney Springs and Disney invited us out to celebrate National Hamburger Day. The Lux Burger has a revamped menu and then they're also giving away free Impossible Burgers for the new movie Bob's Burgers at AMC Theaters. And then later on tonight, we're gonna head on over to our first ever H2O Glow Nights at Typhoon Lagoon. Anywho's, let's go do this. It is a beautiful day today here at Disney Springs and I'm so excited to try some good hamburgers and then like I said later on we're gonna go to Typhoon Lagoon and that's gonna be so exciting so it's gonna be a very epic day. I love the fact that Disney Springs always does these really cool festivities for National Hamburger Day. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they celebrate everything here. They have for all the holiday seasons. They even had something for National Churro Day just a couple of days ago. So it's really cool, and I'm so happy that they invited us out. So thank you so much, Disney. And uh, I'm excited. I'm ready to eat some burgers. And here it is, Deluxe Burger. I'm so excited. This is probably the best place to get a burger on National Burger Day. And I hear that they revamped the menu a little bit. So I'm excited to try. Like I said before, Disney actually did invite us out to try the burgers here for National Burger Day. But I mean, they didn't need to invite me out because I come here all the time anyway. I do love the burgers. So I'm excited to try a big variety of different burgers. And uh, I guess we're just gonna take a look at the menu. Here is a look at the menu. We've got a classic cheeseburger, a barbecued burger, a pizza burger, a pizza burger, buffalo chicken sandwich, plant-based burger, and then of course the fresh cut french fries. And oh, I don't know, I think maybe we'll start with the classic cheeseburger, but I really, I'm feeling something for that pizza burger. I'm feeling something. Other than burgers and shakes here, one thing that uh, they're known for are their sauces and they have a 1921 sauce and I don't think I've ever tried it before so today would be the first time that I get to sample that. Like I said, I'm a little nervous about trying the 1921 sauce, but luckily they have the recipe right over here from Grandma. So it tells me everything that's in there, and I think I'm good to go. I think I'm going to try it. And it's nice that Grandma left this behind so everyone knows her secret sauce. On top of the 1921 sauce, they have some amazing sauces. They've got garlic ranch, chipotle mayonnaise, truffle aioli, they've got stout barbecue, buffalo ranch, and then of course the 1921 sauce on the side. I wanna give, I wanna show you guys a little bit of it though. So I'm gonna actually put it in this little souffle cup, two ounce souffle cup. But this is what the 1921 sauce looks like. It looks good and uh, grandma knows best. And here it is, the classic burger. I got it just the way it is, but without the cheese. I don't like the cheese usually on here. Now there is a pizza burger I wanna try that has a nice mozzarella cheese on it. And that sounds interesting. I always like pizza burgers, but this one is just straight up classic with that 1921 sauce on it. You can see it right there. And also I got myself some fries and then the bourbon bacon milkshake. Look at this. I am so excited. Like this is the perfect combination for National Burger Day. So we're gonna give the bourbon bacon milkshake a try and I'm gonna first take a sip and then I'm gonna eat the bacon. Oh, that's good. Oh, that is really good. You can taste the bourbon and it just goes together. It blends really well together. Hmm. Wait, now I'm gonna go for the bacon. Oh boy, this is actually gonna be difficult because the, the bacon is melting everywhere. I mean, the, uh, the milkshake is melting everywhere, but here we go. I'm going in for a bacon milkshake bite. Look at that, here we go. Oh boy, I got milkshake on my beard. But no joke, this is phenomenal. I love this milkshake, and they also have a s'mores one that I really wanna check out. I like it. All right, we're going in for it. And another thing is, is I like being able to taste the patty. Like I like actually being able to taste the hamburger meat. And I know this is a mixture between uh, brisket and chuck. And like, I, I'm kind of nervous about the 1921 sauce, but high hopes. And I'm gonna keep it in my little, my little wrapper in case I drop it a little bit. So we're gonna go in for the first bite here. We're going all in. Grandma did a great job on that 1921 sauce. And the bun itself is just so good. Like, I love it. And I didn't know until I went in there and they told me that the buns are made fresh at Amaretts and that kind of blew my mind. Like, I was like, wait, what? Because I love Amaretts and I love burgers. So like putting those together and having a crossover is epic. 
the burger is seasoned perfectly just the way I like it too. So like that always adds, you have to, the meat's gotta be seasoned. Look at me, the meat's have got to be seasoned. Why am I going Italian on a burger? I don't know, but I do like it. It is very good. And I do want to try the pizza burger. So I might try it because they are cooking up. It's kind of like a sampling right now. So we can try all the burgers that we want because it's National Burger Day. But I mean, this is actually good just on its own like this. Another little fun fact before we dive into these french fries, they actually hand cut these every single day too. And these are probably up there on my top, like, I would say top five favorite french fries in Walt Disney World. Well, I would actually go top three. I mean, there's an extensive list there, and I would definitely have to get down and crunch my numbers to put them in order. But they are very unique and very good. I don't like just regular plain Jane french fries. These have a little pizzazz to them. A little french fry pizzazz. You know what I'm talking about? You, you guys know what I'm talking about. Also, fun fact, I know that we have bacon in our milkshake, but does anybody else dunk their french fries in? Kind of like Wendy's and they're frosty. Look at this. Oh boy, that is the way. I do it all the time with the frosty, you know what I mean? I like to call it the frosty hack. Even though it's not a hack, it's, it's kind of just a thing. Like, I, I feel like a lot more people do it than what I think. You know what I mean? I think it's kind of a thing, uh, like a staple when it comes to Wendy's and frosties and fries. All right, now that we have the classic, I think we should turn our attention to the pizza burger. That's why I was doing the Italy thing, because I knew the pizza burger was coming. And here it is, the burger I've been looking forward to most. It comes with a Parmesan tomato toasted bun. Look at that. And then it's got fried mozzarella, tomato sauce. It's like a fried mozzarella patty tomato sauce, and then a uh, pepperoni, but they look like bacon strips. This looks phenomenal. I have to say that right now. I love pizzas and I love burgers, and right here is probably the perfect combination for me. So we're going for it. We're going for it. Here we go. First bite. There it is. That's the one. The silver tuna, Marv. That's the one. I love it. It's so good. What a combination of flavors. I'm like impressed. I am seriously impressed with this burger right now. I kind of just want to run around and act like the hamburglar. <laughs> I love this burger so much though and the pepperoni is phenomenal. The pepperoni is probably my favorite thing. You immediately taste that as soon as you bite into it. It is so good. Another really awesome thing, when you eat at Deluxe Burger, if you come out and sit on the patio, you get this amazing view of the springs. Look at this over here. Isn't it beautiful? Holy moly. I love it. All right, it's official. The pizza burger reigns supreme. That was so good. Phenomenal. The pepperoni, the tomato sauce, the bun, all of it. Like, I loved it so much. That is probably my favorite burger. Sadly, though, it is a special burger, so it is limited time only. Like I said, I come to Deluxe Burger all the time, and I like to come out and try their specials, and they usually have, like, a different burger, like, depending on the season or the month, and uh, I'm not too sure how long that one's going to be on there, but I highly suggest you try it. If not, come on out, get the classic, get the 1921 sauce, a little, uh, little bit of Grandma's Secret Sauce, and you won't be disappointed. And here we are, the Bob's Burgers movie celebration. Look at this, it's like a party happening over here. We're gonna go in there, oh, we're gonna spin a prize wheel. I love spinning prize wheels. We're gonna try some Impossible Burgers. This is really, really nifty, I'm excited. Wow, this seriously is a good time right now. I mean, the party is happening here. <laughs> Hi, how are you? And I'm not tired, and these are Impossible Burgers, so we're really, we're really doing a good job to help celebrating National Hamburger Day. So I believe you get the free Impossible Slider no matter what, but you get to spin the wheel to win an additional prize, and there's some good, there's some good prizes on there. <laughs> Looks like they've got free movie tickets, Polite Pig gift cards, They've got a little bit of everything here. Oh, a Polite Pig gift card! Holy moly! Yeah, wow, oh, I love it! Thank you! Very fancy! Oh, very cool! 
Yes, 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 absolutely. Oh, oh, now I get this too. This is the way. <laughs> Oh my lord, how fun and exciting is that? That was so awesome. And the people that are doing the Impossible Burgers is Polite Pig. So I got myself a free $15 uh, gift card for Polite Pig from the prize wheel. And then we got ourselves a little Impossible Slider. Look at this. It's such a cute little burger. It really is. I cannot wait to try this though. Look at that. We're going to take our flag out, even though I should keep it in. I'm going to try to bite it while the flag is still in there. And I'm excited to see like the impossible effect. Is it impossible? We'll find out. Wow. That's impossible. I wonder if that's how they got their name. Like they just went up to somebody and was just like, hey, why don't you try this hamburger? And then they try it and they're like, it's real good. And then they're like, it's not meat. Like, can you imagine? And they're like, what? That's impossible. But it is so good, holy moly. And it's like a little square patty too, which is funny. Really giving me the Wendy's vibes today. I got a lot of Wendy's on my mind. I'm pretty sure they're only doing it for this weekend though. So if you're not here uh, tomorrow, well actually if you, you have two more days maybe, you can come down and check it out. But it's so awesome. Like free burgers at Disney Springs. Get them while they're hot. Get them while they're hot. All right, now that the burger business is taken care of, I think we're gonna head home and get ready to go to H2O Glow Nights at Typhoon Lagoon. And hopefully the storms kind of keeps away, even though it doesn't matter if it's gonna rain because we're gonna be in a water park, but uh, the lightning could be a, a Debbie Downer. And just like that, we went from hamburgers at Disney Springs to Typhoon Lagoon. I'm all dressed up and ready for a nice pool day and to try some really good food. I've never been to H2O uh, Glow Nights here at Typhoon Lagoon, so this is my first time. But it's pretty much like a big, gigantic night party with tons of lights and amazing, colorful food. And I'm excited to share it with you guys. If you don't know what the H2O Glow After Hours event is, it's a special separate ticket event here at Disney's Typhoon Lagoon and it's basically a big glow party with really awesome snacks and it's only on Saturdays and there's not many of them actually out there so it's really hard to come by tickets so I'm very excited to cover it. This is like brand new territory for me. Dive into this summer's splashiest, flashiest fun under the stars select nights this summer and the, tonight's the first one gotta get a special little wristband there it is excellent thanks so much i'm hanging out with my friends chris and maria from lake buena visitors lbv tv and they actually gave us a glow uh, wristband too isn't that cool I, got it on. I wanted to catch you guys. I wanted to catch you guys struggling trying to put it on, it. <laughs> but he got it. I was struggling with mine for a while. Like a <laughs> no, no, I struggled. She had to put mine on because I couldn't figure it out. <laughs> yeah. There you go. No, I don't know. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, they glow. Collars for dogs. Yeah. Yep. It's a, it's a, it's a flea collar. It's a shocker. Yeah, no. You're bad. <laughs> <laughs> We made it inside the park and we found ourselves a spot. Someone said the most important thing when you actually come to one of these events is go to find a good spot and hold it down so you have somewhere that you can go back and forth to. So we found a pretty amazing spot luckily. We are right here next to the wave pool and look here comes the wave. Oh holy moly! This is such a great spot. I am so excited. We got the whole entire area to ourselves. Look at Chris, just chilling there. Yeah, this is it. This is it. This is the good stuff. Yep. I brought my GoPro with me, so I'm gonna be able to film on some of the rides or like the Lazy River. But before we switch over, I wanted to show you guys my fit check for Typhoon Lagoon. I got my Thrifty Land hat on because I couldn't really wear any of my fancy fedoras. And I got the lightsaber Roosevelt tux. Take a look at this. I love it. It's got all of the lightsabers on it going all the way down. And I think it's just appropriate because it's glow night and lightsabers glow. So I thought this is the one. I'm not really that confident in myself, so I might just actually keep my shirt on. I'd rather have a good time and feel comfortable than try to stress out and not feel uncomfortable. You know what I mean? So we'll see how the night goes. 
Wow, it is like the perfect day to be at a water park. And I can't wait till later on tonight when it actually gets dark out and everything glows. This is going to be so amazing. Look at that. Look at the ship up there and the sun. The after hours event doesn't start till 8 o'clock, but like I said, you get to come into the park at 6 o'clock and the park closes to regular guests at 6 o'clock. So you'll be able to get on all the attractions and everything that you wanted to, but the special food and drinks don't come out until 8 o'clock, like the main festivities. And a lot of places close down and reset before it's time for that to actually happen, except for one place is actually open from 6 to 8. So in case you're looking to get something to drink or just a quick uh, snack or something like that, this is the only one. The place that's open between 6 and 8 is Let's Go Slurpin. And it's kind of near the front of the park. And they, this is actually a coffee stand, but I think that's closed at the moment. A part of the after hours is actually free Mickey premium bars. Look at this. And also free popcorn, too. Hi. Uh, Mickey premium bar. I'll take it. And is there free popcorn, too? Yes, not at this station, but I have plenty around the park. Oh, okay? all right. Well, thank you. Free Mickey bars for me all day long. I am so excited. Ears first. Cheers. It's truly incredible how these uh, premium bars are not melting at all yet. That is, that's impressive. We, took down the road. we decided to come over back to our base camp. Reservations required and we have it all here. Oh, look, and there's Sister Walnut. <laughs> I think I'm going to switch over to the GoPro now. Uh, I don't film on GoPros often, but, but I figured I'd give it a try. So the audio I know is going to be different. I'm sure the picture is. And I'm excited to just kind of give it a go. This is, this is a mango and lime go with Mai Tai. And that's for H2O Glow Nights. H2O Glow Nights. Only How is it? Play. It's delicious. Give us a taste test. Sweet. Delicious. They also make one in habanero as well. You just look like summer right now. I am summer. <laughs> I am summer. I acted too soon. I think what we're gonna do is get food first because we want to try all the special food items, and then we're gonna do some water attractions. So that's when I have to bring out the GoPro. But we gotta eat food before we go swimming. I feel like that's the thing that you need to do. And then you gotta wait 30 minutes because you don't want to get a cramp. Wait, no, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Chris is trying to set up a uh, picture for us so we can do a group photo, but he is using his flip-flops. Innovation. Innovation. Right, Innovation. Kristen, stay over there. <laughs> right there. You guys look like the party crew. H2O! H2O yeah! yeah! Wally! Wally! <laughs> he does, he says Wally! You did good! <laughs> Wow, they have all different animal characters in the Lazy River, like as floaties. I'm so excited. Oh, what? Look, here comes, here comes Sully. Look at, there's Sully right there. Oh my lord, and they also have Kevin. Wow, look at how beautiful this is. We're gonna have an amazing sunset today. I mean, this is really, really awesome. I haven't done much, but I've been enjoying myself a lot. And, uh, oh, Serena Ray joined us today. Hi friend, how are ya? Is this gonna be a fun night? I'm very excited. Very excited. <laughs> Kristen got the special Kristen Typhoon Lagoon. The uh, Miss Tilly Sipper. The Miss Tilly special Sipper. Event, very fancy, look at that. And then we also got a lot of other oh special event food. We've got a rainbow, like neon Mickey pretzel. Believe it or not, this is cheese. That's cheese? Look at this. Yeah. Look at the blue cheese! That is cheese. It's a blue cheese! <laughs> <laughs> Another fun thing is this churro right here. It's just a churro, but with colorful, fun salt, and I think it comes with uh, colorful dipping sauce, too. Oh, really? We got a purple one. I think it's over there. So is it not like a blue raspberry churro? I don't know. That'd be fancy. It. It's a blue raspberry flavor? Is it blue raspberry yeah. flavor? Oh. Is it really? Oh, I love blue raspberry. See you there. Churro's up. <laughs> Oh, it is blue raspberry flavored. Now I think I'm gonna try the rainbow uh, Mickey pretzel, but it's missing an ear, so I got the other ear there. But I think it's just like literally a Mickey pretzel with rainbow sprinkles on it. But I like it because I like rainbow sprinkles. Like blue cheese. Oh, I'm not touching that cheese. <laughs> oh, look at it. Your your fingers are stained. Are they? No, that's from no. the salt. No, oh, that's from the churro. And the churro. Uh, <laughs> are you eating My the? Wait, are you doing the, the, the blue churro with no, the blue cheese? No! No! Oh God. <laughs> but now we gotta try it. Ears first. Mm. 
as we're actually making our way back to the front of the park look at this right here isn't it amazing look you can see the balloon over at disney springs this is gorgeous what a night what a time to be alive got myself a pina colada look at this Hi, how are you? Serena got the, what is it called? Lo mein noodle salad. I'm just mad that Nate is like not into this. It's so pretty though. I'm not into that. Look at those noodles. He said it looks good. It's cold and refrigerated. He said it looks good. And look, even the little egg. Oh boy. Well, let's get your first taste test here. Okay, hold on. Okay. Hold on. I want to get some of the noodle. Oh my goodness. How does it look? It looks good actually. Oh, look at that. Oh, it actually looks good. Actually looks good. It smells good. It's not bad. It's not bad? It doesn't have a lot of dressing, so I feel like you'll like it. Ooh. Um, I'm going to try the noodles. I'm going to give them a go here. It's actually not that bad. Oh, it's not bad at all, but it's just cold. It's not bad though. It's like yeah. a, it's like a regular like chicken salad. It's cold lo mein. <laughs> I think it's the jerk chicken when it was marinated. Oh, the jerk chicken is good. Yeah, it's I like the it. That's not too shabby. Looks like they have a big dance party up here. I think we're gonna make our way to check it out. Look at this! What a time! A little DJ dance party. Ah, shake it up! We got the fancy drinks here. Encanto drink. The Encanto drink. The Encanto drink. Oh, fancy. The Ooh. And then this is the Lightning Lemonade. Yes. I'm excited for that one. Enjoy. All right. We switched to the GoPro. It's time for the Lazy River. <laughs> oh, yeah. Somebody's in the Mickey one right there. And then Kevin. Oh, it's so warm. I want to get a special one, but I don't think I'm going to get one. I might just get the sparkly one. I don't see any other ones. Oh, there's a Nemo. Are oh, you getting Nemo? You get Nemo. I'll get this blue one. If it's a special one. <laughs> this is just us now. You like your floaties? Yep. I'm happy. <laughs> Hold. <laughs> I'll never let go, Jack. <laughs> yes. Oh, there we go. I like it. This is the way. <laughs> I'm happy with this right here. We got a nice little seat floating around. He's coming in hot! He's coming in hot! I don't want to do it! Oh no! Nemo swimming out to sea! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not lining you up, I'm trying to help you! You're making me I'm trying to help you! I'm trying to help! <laughs> I'll take a video of you. I remember watching that now, saying I gave you that. <laughs> Wally! <laughs> Wally! <laughs> Eva! <laughs> Eva! You're like a ballerina in that. <laughs> All right, we're coming up on our first ride of the day. Prussian Gusher. Wait time, 15 minutes from this part. Sanitize. We gotta wait for our friends though back there. You got a banana? Yeah. We're doing pineapple. We're almost there. Now this is a water coaster, like a water slide roller coaster. I'm so excited. I'm excited too. Yeah, a little nervous, but. I've done it before. Oh, you have? Oh, well then we're good. I don't remember it. Oh, you don't remember it? No. Oh boy. I probably like closed my eyes for half of it. I don't like the back. We 
good. Three feet. We did it! Woo! It's hot to get out. I'm gonna hop myself out. Ready? There we go. Now I can help you. <laughs> All right, that was so much fun. I loved it. It was great. I really, we were getting airtime there. Like it was really impressive. But uh, now I think we're gonna grab a snack and then uh, do the group one. <laughs> Quick snack break, grab ourselves a Mickey ice cream sandwich and a popcorn. Thank you. Oh yeah. <laughs> now we're actually making our way to Miss Adventure Falls. This is the newest one. And look at the sea right here. Wait, where's the wait time at? Oh. Five minute wait. All right, let's do it. Here comes our trusty steed, precious cargo. Number eight. Hop <laughs> on in. Do you see what's in it? Oh, look at that! Oh boy, here we go. You're going backwards. I don't like that. Well, that kind of felt weird. <laughs> Oh, now we're stopping. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Oh, boy. Holy moly. What is that? Oh, my Lord. No! <laughs> I don't like going down backwards. I can't see. I love it, though. Oh boy, we're coming in hot. Oh no! Ah! All right, we made our way down to the wave pool. The big wave is coming any second. I'm going for it. I'm going for the big wave. Oh no, here it comes. I wasn't expecting that! <laughs> All right, I'm going back for more. Oh no! Ah! We're not gonna make it! We're gonna make it! I'm holding my nose! I lost my glasses! And I caught him! Now I'm back on the regular camera and it's time to call it a night. The event is over. It ended at 11 o'clock, but it was so much fun. I literally had a blast here today and I want to come back. I want to do it again. Like I loved it so much. I love the fact that they have lockers here and they actually have changing rooms. So luckily I brought a change of clothes and I'm going to get dried up in a, in a jiffy. I really hope that I'm going to be able to use the GoPro footage that I actually used riding the rides. I don't, I've never used a GoPro before. Like I've never, like, you know what I mean? So I'm not too sure how it's going to work out, but if it's in there, I'm glad you enjoyed it. If not, there was some spectacular ride footage that unfortunately I don't know how to share with you. But overall, I had an amazing day. Like today was fantastic. I loved it. Like from uh, wake up to now, like it's like 12 o'clock. Look, I'm looking, I don't even have a watch. This is just my uh, magic band. Not even a magic band. But anywho, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it. Make sure you check out all of my friends in the video. I'll put a link in the description with all of their channels. It's just been amazing. So we'll see you next time. Bye!